Hey there guys, we're taking a look at Project Cars 2 running on the i5 11.35G7 and the game is currently running at 1080p with the lowest possible settings I could set the game to. Now the performance here is actually pretty bad because of the fact that the 1% lows are kind of just all over the place. I mean, just look at those frame temps. They are spiking like crazy and we're not necessarily doing a lot here, you know? And uh, this is one of those games where I just really, really suck at it because I am not used to playing these types of racing games. So literally like every race I would have to restart like 50 times and just slowly get better at each section it was actually a lot of fun but it's definitely a completely different style of racing game that i'm used to playing and i wish that the one percent lows were a little bit better than what they are right now the game just really did not feel as responsive as i wanted it to you know and i feel like a lot of it has to do with the fact that frame times are just spiking all over the place like that so you're getting very very inconsistent frame rate and it just seems like you're asking a lot out of the game to try to keep a consistent experience at 1080p because this is pretty much as low as we can set everything to 720p had also some issues but it did help alleviate a lot of the problems specifically the one percent lows get at least a decent enough uplift that playing the game felt a lot smoother with these driving games really the fps is kind of just there to almost give you a more responsive experience and i'm happy to see that 720p is actually really really playable compared to 1080p which is a pretty good sign and i would say that this is probably the best way to go about playing the game i don't know if i'd continue to play it because i don't know if this is really the style of racing game that i would want to play on here i think i would rather play this on my full desktop where i would have the most consistent experience although this game really seems to just prefer any other method of input than like you know a controller or I guess even a keyboard because with the controller I felt like every small little movement of the the joystick would just end up throwing me around sometimes so I feel like this might just really need a steering wheel I'd actually like to try out a steering wheel on a system like this to see if like it actually can be pretty enjoyable like that or not but I hope you found this video useful if you did be sure to subscribe and I will see you guys next time